Hello you guys. Do something with myself for you girl in Nigeria and you think it's okay, but the quality is terrible. Yesterday, I was talking to you guys yesterday. Like, to do it today, but because of, I cannot be having headache. Eat. Hello you guys. Yeah. Hello you guys. Welcome to a new day. You guys, today is actually Monday and this is like past 3, if not almost 4 p.m. Let me check the water can. It's actually 3 for the 3 p.m. And I'm just turning on the camera for the first time today. And you guys, I really, really wish I could put myself together. Just, you know, like kind of just do something with myself for you guys like that was one of the decisions i made um at the beginning of 2024 that before i turn on the camera i'm gonna make sure i'm properly put together but you guys that's not happening because of how hot the weather is i was leaving it i left a comment on someone's um uh, post today on youtube talking about how hot the weather is even with all the water we're drinking um we cannot sleep at night and with the lack of electricity like the frustration is beyond me like i don't even know how else to explain like to describe what we're going through right now and then i'm watching other people's content in other parts of the world and they are talking about how hot the weather is so it's not just nigeria if you're in Nigeria and you think that they've shifted, I mean they've relocated Hellfire to Nigeria, trust me, you're not the only one going through this. As in this, what do I call it? Should I call it trauma? You're not the only one going through this. Like the heat is something else. Like you have your bath like two, three times in a day and you will still not bother to put on any uh, lotion, moisturizer, whatever, because you know that as soon as you're coming out from the bathroom, you're gonna start sweating again. My clothes are all wet. Like every little thing I do, the minute I finish, I will go stand by the window or I'll go downstairs to get in enough air to dry myself up. You guys, it is great. Welcome to a new day. I'm using the quality of this my camera is so bad very very bad so I have to add some lighting to it just to brighten it up a little bit so you guys can see the ring light at the back I have this mini first selfie ring light that's what I use whenever I'm using this camera because the quality is bad I just need to brighten it a little bit the audio is okay but the quality is terrible um, welcome to a new day it's uh, Tuesday the 12th of March 2024 it's about 11 26 a.m i've been sitting down over there trying to get some work done but you guys i woke up today with this banging headache that i cannot explain let me just sit down like i woke up this morning with this banging headache that i cannot explain i don't know why my head has been aching um <clears throat> since i woke up even though okay let's just say i think it's probably because i have not been getting enough sleep for some time because of how hot the weather is yesterday i was talking to you guys yesterday and i was talking about i was complaining about how hot the weather is then i started watching other content creators around the world and you know their story is relatable like let me not say was because it's still the it's still the reality on ground their story is very much relatable like you guys the weather is freaking hot it's hot to the point where you can't even explain what's causing the heat and then later in the later at night yesterday it rained and i was so happy i was so excited if not that it was already dark i would have gone to film the rain because this one was heavier than the ones you guys had seen in the past vlog but the problem was by the time it was like 1 a.m. thereabout, the weather became very hot. We could not sleep at night. And that was frustrating. And for some reason, I think the mosquitoes are back. They've been back for a while because I've been, you know, like trying to clean up and 
spray the entire place and just but somehow the mosquitoes keep coming in and I don't leave the doors open so I don't know where they're coming from I don't know how they get in I don't even know you know like I can't explain that I had finished treating malaria about over a week ago that was before my seven days OMAD which I did not complete I stopped at day five because I realized that I could I cannot be observing intermittent fasting during the weekend because that would kind of interfere with the family plans that we have so I'm like I was successful I was successful like I had five days of successful OMAD five days of successful intermittent fasting eating once a day instead of seven days it ended at day five so I was thinking I was going to be able to continue yesterday but I've been having this headache since yesterday and this morning I woke up it was even more intense than it's been it was yesterday anyway I'm thinking maybe it would be wise to go take like two hours nap maybe by the time I get I get up I'll feel better but I don't know I don't know because I already will gone I've already gone in lay down for like 30 minutes and then came out because you know how it is when during the day I find it difficult to go lie down because I'm always feeling guilty I don't know who else is like me who else feels guilty when they are lying down during the day I'm always on my feet I'm always trying to get something done uh, probably reading I'm just always doing something so the whole thing about lying down has never really been my thing except when I want to go to bed at night you know but right now I guess with the headache I don't think the headache has anything to do with medical I think it's more of like a stress thing like not getting enough sleep and I think my body is just telling me you need to get some rest to do laundry obviously and just they keep give in I'll simply just take fresh some more. You guys, I've gotten like 30 minutes of sleep. Not really sleep, but you know, nap. I nap for like 30 minutes. And then I'm going to take my shower. And right now, I want to go. This The, the house is really hot. My hair is really fall, falling out. My hair is really falling out, but it's because my hair was so short when I made it, so that's why it's falling out. I keep saying I'm going to go to the lady's, um, uh, what they call it, shop to get her to fix all of this hair. I wanted to do it today, but because of I cannot be having headache and then be going to get my hair done. So uh, let's see how tomorrow goes. If I feel much better tomorrow, I'll have to go there to get the hair done. I don't think I have all of the sun cut. And this is not all. I think there is some somewhere. I have some somewhere, I'm not really sure where. Anyway, I think I'll find it. I'll find this when I'm ready to go. But the hair is just, this is two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. It's about nine here. Uh, I'm supposed to have some somewhere. So, I'll have her fix it as soon as maybe by tomorrow. I need to get more of this. I really like it. These are uh, what they call it hair growth booster, new generation hair growth booster serum. I don't know if you guys can see it. It really feels good on the scalp.
So under the staircase is quite cool compared to the house. So I'm just gonna get, go there, sit down to get some work done while I wait for the kids to get back from school. God, the heat is so much. Hey guys. Mm. The most beautiful creature. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> You'll be like, <laughs> I feel better. So now I'm becoming silly. <laughs> I'm thinking I need to get some, I need to take some drinking water along, but I'm worried that I might want to pee. And <laughs> I don't want anything that will make me leave the position I'm going to be sitting for a while. But I think I should be taking some water along. Your confidence makes me confident. I could love you for a long time, baby. I've never seen you hesitate. That's when I start to wonder. If maybe you met me in another life. Cause how you love me so right. How you love me so right. Like maybe you met me in some time. Follow me. 
you guys i'm just coming in from the market it's an impromptu um impromptu market run because we just wanted to go check for yam and then we we couldn't buy the yam where we wanted to buy the yam was so expensive so the, the person we buy normally buy yam from is still uploading yam so he said that we should he said that he was going to he said that he was going to let us know when they finish uploading so we can come buy some yam so i just said to buy something to make a little bit of soup this is a odusa ugu bought some fish bought some meat then i bought some underwears for everybody in the house with some batting bowl some fresh pepper yellow and fresh pepper i bought some crayfish that was just osha that is all of the things i was able to buy it wasn't planned like the market runs wasn't planned but uh, i just had to take advantage of the fact that we are around the vicinity to buy the things i'm going to use to make soup because we haven't had soup in like almost a week now but we're gonna have soup we're gonna have soup but before i start cooking soup i want to first of all finish the video i'm editing i need to finish that video because tomorrow is thursday